And good away, welcome to Big D Country. Uh, I am Prince DJ. Your lovable widower. I mean, I mean, I'm about to be 50 in November. And all I've been doing is struggling. Struggling to fit in. Struggling to survive. Struggling to get to my favorite places. Struggling to eat. Struggling to get more citizens of Big D country. Struggling to do this. Struggling to do that. Struggling ever since my late wife died. That's all I've been doing is struggling. I mean, what? even when I came here to Galveston, I didn't know I was going to still struggle when I came into Galveston. And now the point that, you know, I didn't know if I was going to receive my last paycheck because I've been in, I've been in Texas since May. And I even struggled with the heat. I couldn't even get outside. Like, there was a couple of times that I was forced to get outside in Texas. A couple of times I was forced to be outside. And I've been struggling since birth. The real struggle started when I was born. Born in 1973. I was born legally blind. They said partly blind, but legally blind. Whatever they call it, I was born legally blind. That was my main disability. I had a birth defect. Okay. My other struggles came later. The hearing struggles. And then, back in 2021, the uh, the COVID struggle. And then the rest of it is just uh, economic struggles. And it's all it's just struggle, 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 struggle. You don't want you don't want people to be greedy, but then, then, how the heck are you gonna want people to struggle? There's days that that I've been off and on, living without food, and all I had was chips. Even back at the time when I was in a pad split, I almost had a heart attack because I thought the country was gonna go into the first step to, to ever default. When the Freedom Caucus, and don't get me started on the Freedom Caucus. That's why I love the Problem Solvers Caucus better than the Freedom Caucus, because the Freedom Caucus always want to always want to kill the poor. That's why they said it. The Freedom Caucus always want to kill the poor, and at least the Problem Solvers want to do something that that solve problems. Not the Freedom Caucus. They even want the government shut down. I mean, this is ridiculous. And they were so bold to say that they want the country to go into default. Losing pe- pe- people will be struggling more, even more than I am. I mean, this is ridiculous. Why have the Why have the Freedom Caucus in the first place in Congress? Why should that even be a, a caucus in the first goddamn place? Why? Why? This is why I'm not even a Republican anymore. I mean, I'm not even a Democrat because I don't believe in abortion. I don't believe in stupid, crazy rules, you know, especially ever since this damn pandemic that almost had me going crazy, that I almost went into the hospital if I didn't take the trip to Vegas the last time we was under a lockdown. I mean, once I get this last check, I might not be able to make it past, you know, maybe October November, December. I mean, I'm trying to see a possibility if I could go get SSI. I get SSDI, but I'll probably try to see if I get SSI too. Because right now, they seem to be getting more than people on SSD. Because this is ridiculous. Okay. I have been struggling. You know, I can't drive. You know, I am very limited. Okay. I, I can't go anywhere without people helping. I, I have to rely on people to help. I have to. I, there's no escape. There's no other way around it. I have to rely on other people. But the fact of the matter is what people won't help. It's the fact that when people won't help or can't help. That's why I was wondering, how the hell am I still here? Even when my wife died, I was like, well, how the hell am I going to go on with my, my life without my, my late wife? I couldn't even do it. And yet, eight years later, even though I'm struggling, here I am, I'm on my, still my last damn bag of tips. My last damn bag of tips. My, my money on the tent, I don't even know if it's going to be my last payment or, or, or if I already got my last payment. 
the money on the tan. I don't know if they still come on the week weekend or something like that, because I know food stamps still come on the weekend. So I don't know how they do it in Missouri. I don't even know how they do it in Texas once I switch everything over. So as soon as I do know, when I do get my last check, I'm planning on switching the, the food stamp to uh to Texas. I mean it's 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 it, it it's really it's really a thing. It's really it's really a thing. Then after the tenth, you know, if I didn't get any food at all, I'll be like the tenth to the twenty eighth or the twenty ninth, all the days. You know, it takes three per uh, it takes three days without drinking for a person to die, supposedly. And allegedly, if you don't eat within a month, then you die. Allegedly. I'm saying allegedly because I don't know if it's whole two or not, because when I when I met my last wife, she said I looked like I was uh, in a skeleton of some sort. Yeah. So, yeah. That was uh, back in 2014, back before the great, uh, the great wedding. You know. So, I'm still here. I don't know how many days that I went without eating that time, but I looked like a skeleton, according to my late wife. And obviously, some kind of way, I'm still here for a reason. I don't know what. I don't know why. Besides podcasting, besides comedy, other than that, I don't even know why I'm still here. I don't even have a clue. But all I am doing is struggling. That is all I seem to do is struggle. I don't have a clue why. I mean, I, I, I mean, I've been advertising my businesses during the summer, and I got in trouble with Facebook, and then I'm back on, I'm back on the so-called good graces of Facebook. Okay. And I have been posting again on Facebook. Not as much as I wanted to, but, you know, I have been posting, like, the uh, fact that we're struggling in this heat, which is finally the regular heat now. It's not dangerous like a uh, triple-digit nightmare that I call it. <sighs> I mean, honestly, who do you outside door open like that? Unless it's the bathroom door. I don't know, but I don't know. I don't know. I know I, know I was outside earlier, finally. You know, to get some fresh air, to clear my mind that I haven't been clear since uh since we entered another September triple digit nightmare. I don't again. I don't remember when the last time I had real food. I don't even remember anymore. I know I had real food the first week that I was here, but I don't. I don't remember the that day that I had real food. I know it was Burger King that I do know. Because I did have pizza for Pizza Hut one time when I was that, but that's all when I was first here. But that was all in the first week. This was like, you know, back when um, you know, we had all the deaths. We had the uh, the Bray Wyatt, the uh, Terry Funk, the Bob Barker, the uh, the actors, the singer for Smash Mouth. I mean, we had all these deaths of, in the corner and all within the same week that my late wife passed anniversary. That was the only time that I remember eating. That was the last time I remember eating. The last week of last week of uh, last week of um, August. That was the last thing I remember because I didn't do anything on September second. The uh the home going anniversary. Now it's September ninth, and I don't know. I I just don't know what to do. I just don't know what to do. I mean, just. Uh, I hope they don't keep the doors open so they don't let no flies in. I mean, this is ridiculous. I mean, wow. But anyway, I mean, all I'm just, I just don't like to struggle. It's like there, there's, there's secretly in my brain, I'm asking the Lord to take me home because I can't, I can't deal with the struggle with that. I mean, just struggle, 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 struggle. That's all I'm doing. I've just been begging the Lord, can you please take me home? Is it my turn? I'm begging every day, every day, every day. When is my turn? 
when is my turn? I tried, I failed at times. And then sometimes I even have worse days at GSP because when I can't either win games or I can't, you know, answer questions like that, like that buzzing live rant that I told you about. I did, and then, you know, with the advertising during the summer was so slow, I couldn't even get any anybody looking to my ad at all. Nobody was looking at my ad. I mean, the, uh, the return rate is so slow. Terrible. Why would I hear? Why would I hear? I'm questioning this, and, and it's like, for what? Just to sit here, and then, you know, die of starvation, die of the heat, die of loneliness? You know? I mean, this is... This, this, Wow. I'm just gonna Okay, so okay, so, so let's just say uh, so for instance I made it past my senior citizen and I died of old age, natural causes, whatever, and I die alone. Who's gonna discover me? Okay. Who's going to call David, which is my nasty can? Who's going to call him and let him know that I'm gone? Now, who's going to do all the things that they're supposed to do before home going and yada yada yada? Because I want to go uh, home going at High Street Baptist Church, which is Springfield, and I want to attempt to try to be still be buried next to my wife or cremated first and then buried next to my wife. That was one of my wishes. And. I mean, who's going to do all that when it's going to take me, it's going to take someone days just for someone to, to, to find me? I don't have a wife. I'm not handsome enough to, to find a wife, only to scammers. Then I'm handsome to, to them. I mean, what? I'm just questioning. I'm just questioning. Help me to help me to understand. Help me to understand why I'm here to struggle. I'm just here to struggle. Help me to understand that. I mean, I know I have talent. But then when I try to use it, people are just either saying no or it's not your time. I'm nearly 50, damn it. I'm nearly 50. I'll be 50 in, okay, September, October. Yeah, I'll be 50 in two months. November. I'll be 50 in two months. When can I use the skills that I thought that I did have? God can stop damn struggling. Never? Okay, well, I did uh, speak at PodFest, uh, Podcast Movement through online, and I did do a speaking on um, PodFest once and put on Punchy Catcher, which was fun. But then I couldn't get it uh, get to do it again. And then I'm approaching fifty. I'm approaching fifty. What have I done? Okay, well I haven't gone to jail. Okay. Haven't gotten into an accident, thankfully. Well, except for when I got um when I got hit by a car when I was supposed to have a right to way in Tampa, but still, nobody helped me. Except for the EMT, and they take the wrestling move to save my life. Thank God I usually watch wrestling a lot. But it's just so sad. Here I am asking people for help online, and only a few help. I have like a thousand followers on Facebook, Twitter, aka X, or X, aka Twitter, whatever the way you want to be. Thousand people, and only a few help. Only wanted to real help. What well, says that? And then the rest of the days that I'm struggling. Once I'm done with these chips, I will have no food at all. Do you hear me? I th- do you he- do you hear me? Did I stutter? I said once I'm done with these chips, I will have nothing at all. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. And I'll be struggling from here until I get my rent money. I might have to. I might have to cancel my. If I don't get my money for the ten, then 
I might have to move my uh, ID. I was supposed to get my Texas ID tomorrow. No, not tomorrow. Uh, Monday. Which is unfortunately, ironically, September 11th. Yeah, that anniversary. But also, there's a possibility that I might not be able to go to podcast. And I told you that even the speaker, everybody has to pay their way to podcast. And now, you know, even the speakers have to pay. But speakers, I think they have special price. Because when I saw it on e I was like, oh, wow. Even the speakers have to pay their way? I was like, holy cat. So, but if I don't get the money, because what I'm going to do is I'm going to pay prepay part of the hotel room. Okay. Then after I do that, then get some food. You know, pay all the small bills, but mostly get some food. And and then wait until, you know, wait until I get food stamps. And then, and then, yeah, tomorrow I was going to go to get my ID. Not tomorrow, Monday. Oh, my God, I can't talk straight. Monday. But the fact of the matter is just like, just struggles. Like, where's the help at? Where? I don't know anymore. I don't. I don't. I don't know. I just don't know. But just please keep continuing to pray for me, because when I struggle, I get depressed. Just please continue to pray for me. I ask for this as a pity. Continue to pray for me, because every day that I'm secretly asking the Lord to take me home, I am asking. I'm begging. I'm pleading. So please, this is a big deep country. Please say a prayer. I hate struggling. I hate it. 